Yeah, hard mode is, um, well, it gained that name for a reason. Also, welcome, uh, Blob Junior 85. Oh, I think, I think you've been here before, haven't you? In fact, I think you followed last night. There we go. There's Adamantite. Let's get this mud out of my inventory. So finally, um, I'll have to use a bunch of the ore just to upgrade my uh, Hellforge into something that'll turn the ore into bars. But we're getting there. Oh, I didn't get my potion out quickly enough, and now I gotta find my way back down there or lose six gold. Curses. But I found Adamantite. Actually, I'm gonna show it to the guide real quick. Let's see. So yeah, I need how much? 30 to make a forge. Well, that's a little ways off. Not too far, but it's attainable. Because yeah, I can't even make the bars at this time. That's how. At least I've got a pretty reasonable start on hard mode. It's just a question of... Five solar eclipses. Um, boy, if only that had been blown on winning the lottery. I mean, two in a row is pretty unpleasant, but five is a lot. Okay, this shadow chest has my boss gear in it. Oh, I've got a slush block. I might as well use it. Okay. Armored cloud in a bottle I think I can do without for now. I mean, the the plus three defense is very nice. But, uh... Hmm. You know what, the B-Gun isn't really all that useful now. Not, you know, not since we hit hard mode anyway. So how much Platinum ore do I have? 26. Not enough. It's such a minor upgrade when I consider things now. You know what? I think I'm going to do something rash. I'm going to go get one of those teleportation potions I've been sitting on and use that to find somewhere new to explore. Uh, and if I remember what they looked like. That's just recall. Oh, right there. Okay. Okay, somewhere new. 
with a uh, train cart or train tracks. So I don't know what's causing that weird effect. Um, because there's nothing in my inventory that should be causing it, but every time I seem to hit certain enemies, it just, uh... It just suddenly decides to make that weird purple light. And I have no idea why. Okay, so this... This is going to be more than enough ore to make the forge. Yeah, voodoo demon. Let's let's get him somewhere where he can't do any harm. There we go. Ah. Oh, that's our calicum. Well, that was a short trip. This is, this is way out there. Cool. This is an admittedly dangerous depth to be at because of all the lava, but I can deal with it. Oh wow, 1230 already. Jeez. Today's going quicker than I would have planned. Oh, wow, I'm underneath the dungeon. This doesn't really help with my uh, with my goal, so I'm just gonna leave it alone. But that is amusing. Yeah, so this is a big section of dungeon I never even explored. Jeez, man, it's amazing how big this game actually is sometimes. Uh, oh, and I'm not carrying any gold keys. Well, jeez. I guess I'm just going to leave that chest right there. Oh, that's... that's just our calcum. If you grind it up, it'll become our calcum powder. Now 
now. Might as well pick up the rest of this gold. That track was going to get me hurt. Oh, wait. Yep. Stupid lava. Oh, wait. I'm back up near the dungeon. Okay, so these teleport potions only seem random. Apparently they just like bringing me to the dungeon. Just I haven't uh, looted. I mean, I doubt it'll have anything of use this late in the game, but gotta look, right? Yeah, Splunker Potion, some gold, torches. Nothing too fancy. free New Year's Eve, which is kind of a novel concept for me. Because, you know, it used to be I worked Monday through Friday and all that, and uh, because it was a security gig, it didn't matter if there was a holiday or not. They still needed somebody there, but now it's like, nope, not we. We have New Year's Day off. And I'm going, huh, well, what do I do New Year's Eve? Oh, they, um, when I started this map, it was close to Halloween, so a lot of things I was killing were dropping goodie bags, and one of them is a, and they, they always contained costumes, and one of them was uh, the creeper skin. So uh, that's pretty much what I've been using since the beginning. Also, welcome. I cannot read your name. But I uh, hope you enjoy the uh, the stream. Okay, finally some more ore. Local club, huh?
I tried to visit a certain such local thing once. <laughs> I'm bored. Oh, I see. Okay. But yeah, that is just one of the things that'll drop. I mean, you'll get inundated with uh, with vanity items uh, over Halloween. One I really liked was the Xenomorph skin. It's just the alien from the Alien series. Um, and I used that for a little while. So how much uh, adamantite have I even found? There's palladium, there's... or calcum. Oh, there it is. 49. Yeah, so this this was funny. There, um, there was a local group, and I think we're talking about something very similar. Um, and I, I went to meet them. You know, like, oh yeah, we, we meet at this, this restaurant at this time. I'm like, okay. So I go, and I don't see anyone there. Turns out they were in a private room on the side, and they forgot to mention, oh yeah, just tell the, uh, tell the guy at the door that you're here with us. So, like, I was in the same building with this group and totally missed them. It's, uh... It's pretty much the entirety of my, uh, my alternative lifestyle is stupid, stupid things like that. Uh, yeah, this is sort of my main world. It's mostly, it's mostly just one I set up because of Twitch. Um, you know, I was starting from scratch, so I figure I'd start a new world. I even named said world Twitch, so I would know which one to, uh, open up. I mean, I have another world which is a little farther in a hard world, in a hard mode, but this is catching up fairly rapidly. Oh wow, I didn't even have my Splunker Potion on and I found that. Excellent. So I don't know how much of this stuff I'm going to need to make anything cool. Oh, is that just copper? Boo. Boo on you, copper. You know what you did. Oh, a little bit of gold. Alright, let's head back. Dump my junk in the proverbial trunk. Javelins. No, I'm actually doing fairly well there. It's, I mean, it's a little time consuming, you know, just finding it and all, but, uh, you know, I think I've got things more or less uh, into a fairly reasonable pattern. Oh, yeah, I, there was this big update that I apparently missed, and uh, people were telling me about stuff I've never even seen in this game before. Something called a Moon Lord, which, uh, he sounds fun. And Martian invasions, and I don't know, man, could get wild. What am I going to do with these frickin' javelins? I have no use for them at all. Oh, is he? Okay. There it is. Okay, so now I can place my forge and start making bars. So I can literally just make a dozen of them. Rough. Okay, um. Sword, glaive, and repeater. 
Yeah, I, uh, I have made no fishing spots at all. I have yet to actually even fish for anything. Oh, thanks for following me. I'm bored. I hope you, uh, you enjoy what you see now and in the future. And I hope I do something about that boredom. Thanks. It's, uh, I mean, I pretty much, you, you know, designed it like a slumlord. Just give them all enough room and uh, leave it at that. I haven't done anything fancy, but uh, I'm happy with it. I mean, I had this defensive pyramid thing here, but I've basically not used it since, uh... Oh, another meteorite! Why? Why is a meteorite landing this late in the game? Honestly. Okay, um... Back down I go. Let's uh, try to get a little more, a little more of my uh, adamantite. Actually, you know what? I'm feeling like uh, I started this episode killing a wall of flesh. Let's see if I can just beat him down another time, just for grins. Let's see here. Um, gear. Mana region, yes. Magic power, yes. And then I'm going to keep my... Okay, mining, splunker, and shine are not going to be necessary. Yeah, and I think I may have to do that. Um... Because I've already mined out one, and it provided more ore than I actually require. I mean, I already have a space suit and space gun and, and all that. Plus, I still have enough left over if I want to make a phase saber. Oh. Okay, let's go, uh, let's go kill a wall of flesh. Because he's a big wuss and he knows it. a lovely little coughing fit. Okay. Really? So I've got plenty of regeneration going. Another present that I won't open. You know, usually when I built these in the past, I would set up a, uh, a wooden plank layer. Oh, what's wrong with it?
Oh, jeez. Ten hours, huh? Oh. That, that seems within reason to me. Um, I mean, granted, I'm not really familiar with the various use cases of such a device. But that seems like a fairly minor flaw in the, uh, in the big scheme of things. Oh, another guide voodoo doll. Well, hey. Can only kill the poor guy so many times. There we go. Yeah, he's uh, pretty easy. <laughs> Unfortunately, I have to wait for the guy to spawn to kill him again. Um, contain block, big deal. A laser rifle, not very good. Wow. That was... Uh, Pretty underwhelming. He didn't even drop a medallion. What a jerk. It's like, geez, what did I murder him for? What the hell is that guy? Uh, fairly easy fight. Oh, I've got an empty room there. Good. Well, on that happy note, I think I'm going to call it a day here. Um, basically, I've gotten into hard mode, and I'm almost... I've almost got the top mineral I can use. I mean, granted, I've not fought any of the mechanical bosses and the jungle's way off and the hard mode dungeon of course still has to happen not to mention I still have to scour the jungle for the temple and that's one of the last fights I actually remember doing um, so there's still a lot of game left and this has been eight weeks now that's pretty significant oh wild You've got one crazy setup from what I saw. And I mean, I'm really only vaguely familiar with most most stuff synth-wise. Okay, let's make sure that this can't cause any harm. Couldn't hurt. I mean, I look at it and go, hey, that looks complicated, but that's about all the, uh, all the input I could offer. And there's my jungle guy. How's he doing? Oh, he's got fountains that I won't use, and a bewitching table. Okay, well, you just keep doing your thing, man. All 
All right. Yeah, that's going to be it for this week. I'm going to say thanks for watching, everyone, and uh, thanks for following. I'm bored, and uh, I hope to see you all next time. Yeah, have a good one. Oops. <laughs>